Reiki is a form of alternative medicine called energy healing. I've found it very beneficial in a number of medical problems that I've had and also in helping cope with stress. That's what this video is all about. So stay tuned to the latest episode of the g Meet radio and television personality Gaz Reynolds, the founder of World Domination Records and Great Drive Driving School. Like, comment and subscribe to be part of the journey. This is Gaz Reynolds, the G-Log. The G-Log album is now on sale worldwide. Get your copy now, available at YouTube Music, Spotify and all major outlets around the world. Links in the description below. Welcome, Welcome to another, to another exciting, exciting episode, episode of the G-Log. <laughs> Many years ago, I lived in India for about a year, and unfortunately, I got very, very sick out there. I got dysentery, and I didn't want to return to England. In fact, um, I was so sick, I wouldn't have been able to travel anyway. So I went to see a Reiki healer. Now, I didn't know anything about Reiki then, but um, I soon found out that this guy, he was really, really talented. I didn't tell him anything about my illness at all. And at the time, actually, I suffered with very, very chronic migraines as well. And he, all he did is he spoke to me for a couple of minutes and he put his hand on my stomach. He said, oh, you've got a stomach problem, which I'll sort out in a minute. Uh, first of all, he said, I'm gonna deal with your migraines and you'll never get one again. Now, of course, I was a little bit skeptic, but also at the same time, I felt as if I needed to have an open mind. After all, I was in India and it's a very spiritual country and my mind was opened up to many, many things. Within a few minutes, the Reiki healer, and bear in mind I'd not told him anything about any of my medical conditions, actually told me that I suffered from chronic migraines as well. And he said, don't worry, I'll sort that out first and you will never have a migraine again. Well, I honestly can't tell you what he did to me. Um, all I know is that I was um, kind of in a relaxed state throughout, almost like a kind of sleep, but I was aware that I was having something, you know, done to me that was just very, very relaxing. Anyway, I've never had a migraine since, so I know for a fact, for me, that definitely worked. And I don't feel it was psychological at all because I could actually feel things actually happening to me. Um, I felt a warmth, I also felt tingling around my head, and that's all I can tell you. Then he worked on my stomach. Now, remember, I'd had chronic dysentery. You can actually die from that. And I was so sick that I couldn't even travel back to England. And I'd had medication in India, but it didn't work. So the Reiki healer actually put his hands near my stomach. He didn't actually touch me. I could feel a warm sensation around my stomach. Uh, the heat started to increase. This was just coming from his hands. And then there was a tingling. And then literally a day after I got really violently sick and then I was okay. Now remember I'd had this illness for months. And so to be suddenly fine and no problem at all was amazing. So I got very, very interested in Reiki. And when I came back to the UK, I actually decided to look into it and I even actually trained in Reiki. So what is Reiki? Well, Reiki is a type of energy healing that was developed in Japan by Dr. Mikao Yasui in the early part of the 20th century. Reiki is a form of alternative medicine called energy healing. Reiki practitioners use a technique called palm healing or hands-on healing, which is a universal energy. It is said to be transferred through the palms of the practitioner to the patient in order to encourage emotional and physical well-being. Over the years, unfortunately for me, I've had a number of very, very serious health conditions, which I found Reiki very, very beneficial in aiding the assistance of me making a full recovery. I've had everything from a major stroke where I went blind and I also had sepsis which almost killed me. I've also suffered from bouts of depression as well and I think that's most people have that. But the thing is, I found Reiki just incredibly useful and I'm amazed that I'm still here to this day because I should really have been Sorry about that. So it's been very beneficial for me because I've had so many medical problems over the years. I mean, I almost died of a stroke and I went blind and I was told that I would never see again. And these stories are honestly true. 
I wouldn't make them up. They're, they're genuinely true. And uh, all I can say, no, I'm not wearing dark glasses because I'm blind. I wear dark glasses because I always have done. <laughs> it's, just, it's just something that I do. Now, I don't sleep with them on, although I have in the past, though I have to admit, <laughs> but then I'm a little bit crazy at times. But to be quite honest with you, um, the Reiki brought my eyesight back. That's what I actually believe. I also had a chronic health problem last year with sepsis and I had to have major bowel surgery, wasn't nice at all, almost died. And again, I had Reiki um, from a very good friend of mine who um, got me through those very, very dark days. In fact, the Reiki clinic that I go to quite frequently is actually in my house and I'm gonna show you that a bit later on. You might be surprised what I've got here. So. This is the Reiki clinic. Uh, sorry if the lighting's not great in here, but this is actually in my house and it is actually run as a business as well. But I do come in here myself and have Reiki healing. I can only tell you it genuinely has worked for me. So I don't feel it's something psychological because you can actually feel it working. And there are a lot of clients that actually come here and they report exactly the same things as me. Now this is actually the area where um, I would lay, it's, basically I call it um, a bed, but it's not a bed, it's a, it's, a, it's a bench sort of thing. And I have been in here before, by the way, because I did a video when I first started the G-Log, which was about how Reiki actually saved me. And, um, and I don't want to go into a preachy type of video, but it's something that I'm very interested in, and I know a lot of other people around the world are very, very interested in Reiki and the benefits of Reiki, and my friend, who runs this clinic here is a Reiki master, which is, you know, you don't get any higher than that. And she trained for a very, very long time um, and she's very, very good at what she does. So anyway, I basically lay here and then I go into a kind of semi-sleep. Now I did ask my friend to actually appear on this video, but she's a little bit shy, even though she was a famous TV actress at one point, but she doesn't want to be in front of the camera anymore. I think she just got sick of that business. So I said that I would explain it. And uh, you know, this is where I come and it's part of my house now. Now Reiki really won't be for everybody. And of course there's going to be skeptics out there that are gonna be watching this video thinking, mm, I'm not too sure about that. But to be quite honest with you, I can only tell you from my own personal um, you know, experience that Reiki has worked on me. I was told that I would be blind for the rest of my life after a stroke. And I was very, very determined to try anything that would actually help me regain my sight, even though I was told that there was no hope and it would never happen. Well, I can only tell you that I had three Reiki sessions and I actually had full eyesight. So that's all I can tell you. Um, I can't explain it. Um, I just know that it worked on me. It's the same when I almost died last year from sepsis. Again, I had Reiki and I got through it. Now, of course, you know, I am a very determined person as well, so I'm not denying that, but I know for a fact that Reiki really did help me. I could feel it working and I could see the results. So I'm just talking from my own personal experience. Oh, by the way, if you're a Reiki master or a Reiki healer, practitioner, or if you're just somebody that's interested in Reiki or has had Reiki at some point in your life and you would like to share your stories and your comments, please leave your comments down below. I would really love to hear from you and I would like to build up my community and share these stories with others. It could be very, very helpful for somebody that's very, very unwell. Now, as I said, I'm not an expert in Reiki, so I'm not pretending to be. I can only talk about my own personal experiences, and I can honestly say, through some very, very difficult times in my life, whether it be stress, or some very, very dangerous medical conditions that I had where I almost died, I can honestly tell you that I managed to get through with Reiki treatment, and I got my eyesight back, and you know, I, I survived from a very, very serious stroke. It was something that was unexpected. It just suddenly happened to me and I went blind and I was told that I'd never see again. And as I said, don't be fooled by these dark glasses because I'm not blind now. <laughs> I just happened to wear these. Somebody asked me the other day, why are you always wearing dark glasses? And I said, I always have done ever since I was a kid. It makes me stand out from the crowd. That's what I said. So <laughs> it is nothing to do with that at all. But I can tell you that when I had sepsis uh, last year, and I almost died from that, I was literally two and a half hours away from, from dying, 
Uh, my friend who's a Reiki master was actually there and she was doing Reiki treatment on me. And even the doctors said it's quite possible that that's what kept me alive. You know, I, I don't deny that I'm a fighter. I, I'm really not somebody that follows the crowd. I've very much got my own mind. And so, uh, but this is something that I really do believe in and I just felt that I wanted to share it on video because there might be other people out there that are interested in Reiki or they may well have been sick and maybe this could be, or may be sick and this could be something that could help you. That's the end of today's video. If you've enjoyed it, then please give it a big thumbs up. If you've got any stories of Reiki and how it's helped you, then please leave your comments down below. I would love to hear from you. Thanks for tuning in and I'll see you soon. If you live in London and want Reiki treatment, visit www.healinghandsinuk.com or call 07 800 942 291. Please share this video and leave your comments below. Hi mortals, I'm Jesus. You can now purchase Gaz Reynolds Presents The G-Log, album volume one from Apple Music, Spotify, and all major outlets around the world. Includes the massive hits, Electronic Kama Sutra, I Only Hear You, and Dark Lady. This is one heavenly experience you won't forget. By the way, make sure you like comment and subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification button so that you can watch every episode of the g-log religiously Out now, Gaz Reynolds' new album, The Electric Wedding Kama Album, Sutra, as featured on Big Review TV Electric and Radio Kama Harrow. Sutra, Electric. Available Electric at iTunes Kama and Sutra, all major Electric. outlets worldwide.